Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here. A very good afternoon to you all. I hope you're all well at home. And here we go with the second hunt on the channel today. We actually did a first on the channel earlier on as we look through £1,000 of £20 notes. Yes, you heard that correctly. We were looking for those AA0... Zero, zero? AA01 serial numbers. Need to practice saying that a bit better. Looking for AA01 serial numbers. We did find an AA note in there. Head over, check it out, give it a thumbs up. And we'll try and do one of those every month or so. So here we go, we are back to the norm. £100 of 50p's in this coin hunt. As you know, the aim of the game is to try and find any of those different back commemoratives in UK circulation. Now, I know that there is supposedly rare and common coins. All of them these days seem to be rare. So hard to find. So again, even if you find the most common 50p coin today, the Benjamin Bunny, 25 million released for circulation. I can promise you, you still have done well. Does look like we have stumbled across our first commemorative here, 2020, and it is the Peace, Prosperity and Friendship with All Nations. The withdrawal from the EU coin as we have got a double. We're going to get a turkey strike. I see another one there. We have got a Paddington outside the Tower of London. And we've also got the first Beatrix Potter coin to be released for UK circulation. The Beatrix Potter anniversary. One of 13 different Beatrix Potter designs to be released for UK circulation between 2016 and 2018. Now, yesterday we did actually post a video up about the price explosion of the 2020 Peter Rabbit. Again, the 2019 and 2020 Peter Rabbits were unfortunately not released for circulation. We did have to purchase those online as we find a nice Sherlock Holmes. Now, you could purchase those for between five to 10 pounds, depending on what website you were to purchase them from. At the moment, £25, yes, you did hear that correct, for the 2020 Peter Rabbit coin. The 2019 version is currently around the £15 to £18 mark. Again, unbelievable. Do I think that the prices will increase from that? I honestly don't. I think they will come back down a little bit. I honestly don't know, though. My future valuations aren't always true. So, again, they are just predictions what I think will happen. I do think that they will come down to around the £10 again in a few months' time. Sometimes price explosions do happen, but for a lot of the time, they don't actually stay at that price. A for Angel of the North, 2019 10p. It was up over £30, £35, back down to 20 And I do think that the Angel of the North coin will probably go back to around the £10 mark as well. It isn't in the rarest five of the 2019 Alphabet coins. It's just been so scarce on auction websites that's really the main reason for that coin's value to increase so much and i'm sure in the future when everyone really has worked out the mintage figures correctly when they know the numbers that coin as well will come back down to its price as we move on then we have got the pride coin and we've got another double bagger as we pick up the 1918 representation of the people zach below I know I've seen those legs before, and they weren't the legs of the Sir Roger Bannister. We have got the People's Act coin as well. Again, 9 million of that coin released for circulation five years ago now. Where does time fly? Where does time fly? Where does time go? Time does fly. I can't speak today. Anyway, we're seven coins deep in the commemorative pile. Definitely not complaining with that. We've had a few coin hunts as well. Over 10 for 10 bags, which is definitely a lot higher than the four to six commemorative average. As we look through the remaining bags, I'd just like to say, definitely do not miss out on guest stands coins. You will have until Friday lunchtime to get those guesses in. Also, we do have a giveaway taking place Saturday, 6 p.m. If you do want to play along, as we find a Benjamin Bunny, if you do want to play along on the Last Stand Standing game, head over to that video, it went up yesterday. Comment 2023 at the start. If you're the final Dan in the bowl, you're going to pick up three coins. Second last Dan, you're going to pick up two. And again, a huge shout out to the people that have made this giveaway happen. Norman Graham, Terence Day, they won these prizes. They've already got them and they would like to see them go back out to somebody else on the channel. I really do love the last Dan standing game as well. We haven't really been able to play it over the last couple of months. I have just had my head in too much work. Off for this month though, plenty of giveaways to come. 
and you never know we could even do a week-long special of the last stand standing game towards the end of the month so talking of the end we are on the final bag shields and britannias so far and don't forget at the end of the coin hunt i'll check through all of the coins again maybe i've missed a commemorative as i'm blabbing on maybe there's some shields rare britannias in there if that's the case you'll see them at the start of the next coin hunt video so time to summarize and see what coins we've found also we'll pick the star find as well don't forget please do comment your star find in the comment section below as always everyone's favorites will be different so don't forget to get yours in the comments so the top row we have got the peace prosperity and friendship with all nations a withdrawal from the eu the pride coin the sherlock holmes the people's act bottom row we have got three beatrix potters we have got the anniversary come on dan sort yourself out <laughs> the anniversary Beatrix Potter, Benjamin Bunny, we have got the Miss Tiggy Winkle, and also the Paddington outside the Tower of London. I hope you've enjoyed this coin hunt today. Stay safe and as always, guys. Thanks for watching.